be. You know the tuck love is real when you literally tuck your pajama shirt into your pajama pants. Anyway, the first piece from Everlast okay. is this silky cotton shirt. I am obsessed with this. You guys know how much I love my button shirts, but... <laughs> She sees him walking in a straight line, but that's not really her style. And they all got the same heartbeat, but hers falling behind. Nothing in this world could ever bring her down. Yeah, they're invincible, and she's just in the background. protection serum and like a white and silver bottle but I think it's still the same formula they just repackaged it but I like it because it's so light and liquidy that it uh, sinks in right away so I like to use this in the morning and then all I do is mix my elf and glow radiant moisturizer with SPF and then a little bit of the Drunk Elephant Deep Bronzy Drops together because you need that sun protection especially now that it's getting warmer and the sun is coming out to play finally seasonal depression who I feel like I just come alive in the spring like I get so motivated to spring clean and declutter and organize and deep clean. It's just like the start of a new season and it feels so fresh because you're coming out of, well for me, I'm coming out of like the winter blues and just being cold and it being dark all the time. I look really orange but I swear I'm not. <laughs> just this lighting. So I work that into my skin for a pretty good amount of time because it is really glo uh, glowy and dewy when you mix both those products together. So I just like to take a little more time and mix it or blend it into my skin. Um, but it is kind of like self tan so I do wash my hands after. Okay, let me get out of here. 
I need to feed the cats. really gross. Is that cat on me? No. Okay, is it like that? Okay, throwing that away. That's disgusting. Now I'm going to vacuum the living room. Get that out of the way. And I'm going to use, this is one of my favorite cleaning products, especially if you have pets, the Arm & Hammer OxyClean Pet Fresh Carpet Deodorizer or Odor Eliminator. You just put this down on the carpet. Leave it for like at least 10 minutes and then vacuum it up. I'm actually going to vacuum all the furniture first and then vacuum the floors. fabric softener with a bottle full or a sprayer bottle full of water spray it on your furniture so good Now I'm going to put this pet refresh stuff down.
And while I let that sink and do its thing, I'm gonna make a coffee. This isn't like, obviously you just saw me make it, but this isn't like all coffee. It's mostly ice. Okay. I need to leave in 45 minutes to go to my uh, doctor's appointment, but I have to stop at the post office first because I need to mail in my old phone. I got a new phone. And I just got a case from the AT&T store, but I need to get a better one because it's just like a clear plastic one. So, I might order one off the Apple store later. Turbo! This phone does wireless charging, so I'm not gonna be able to vlog in the car. I need to get a new case and a pop socket. I need a pop socket back in my life. These are frozen. What is my temperature at? I'm just gonna put it on happy. But I'm on my way to the post office and then to the doctor's. I gotta go. <laughs> Put the winter jackets away. Praise be. City. Do not know who I am, but still know that I'm good as long as you're here with me. To be drunk and in love in New York City. And that into morning coffee. Running through the hours talking. I like me better when I'm with you. I like me better when I'm with you. I knew from the first time I stayed for a long time cause um, oh, I got some new pillowcases and a linen sheet set because we only have one sheet set and I like to have at least two so that way on sheet washing day you don't have to like leave the bed unmade. Hi Turbo. You can just switch sheets. What so I got it here? in um I don't know, I just followed you. I got another Richard, set come of the out here, Come in. Sheet set. 
And okay. this, like, sip sip cream. You need me to sit with Lorelai? I'm fine, I swear. I have been sitting without any help. I'm just going to throw all this stuff Mike in the wash. I also got four. I think you'll find them a value. Richard, I need help in here. They're the I'm same sitting with Lorelai, Emily. Emily. We have by them. Really, it's okay. I promise not to stick my finger in any sockets. <laughs> All right. Gonna wash those two. Here I come. Okay. The other, but I moved the bed. Okay. Vacuumed Thanks. a little. Turbo's chilling. I need to wash all the sheets again. Well, the new sheets, and I'm gonna take the old ones off. Not old ones, but the ones that were on the bed off. Wash them all together. Need to wash our throw blankets. And yeah. And now I'm wondering if I put the bed in a good spot because usually the AC goes in that window. But maybe we can put it somewhere else. I also need to measure and make sure the crib is going to fit in this corner right here. Because it's pretty big. But I don't want to get a different one because it's one of those convertible cribs that you can use until it's a bed. So, we got to keep it. Okay, all the laundry is downstairs and ready to go. I can't really like, see in here, but... Put the bed in front of the window, put these back as bedside tables because apparently the dressers we ordered, we got these from Walmart, they're by South Shore London. They're only, they're just particle board, but they're actually pretty good quality. It's like a dark, dark wash. It almost looks black, but it's kind of brown um, on the top and sides, and then the drawer faces are like a gray wash. And there's one in here and one in the living room, I'll show you. But it said it came with bedside tables, but it actually doesn't, so I have to order some. Oh, I'm out of breath, so just using these for now. Oh god. And now, I'm just gonna put some more baby clothes away. I got these the other day at Old Lady. Um, Alex's older sister gave us a gift card, which was really sweet. So, I just picked up some clothes for her. Ooh, one thing I actually do need to do. We didn't have a lot of um, sleepers for her, so I picked some up. Really cute. Um, a few different sizes. Newborn 0336. And. Hi, Jonas. Now I'm just organizing. I have this pink storage bin full of like baby accessories, and all of her clothes are in the other uh, set of drawers on the other side of this bed in one drawer. I don't know how I fit them all in there. They're organized by month, like what size. But Old Navy had some really cute baby clothes. I don't want to unfold them and show you because I fold uh, You know what? Whatever. Whatever. I'll just show you. Let me knit them. I'm so out of breath. So I got some, like I said, sleepers and some onesies. They were having a pretty good sale. And like their baby stuff isn't that expensive, which is good. Um, I got this little pink and white striped one. This is for three to six months. I got thicker ones for when she's a little older because it'll be the fall, winter by then. I think this is three to six months as well. It's really cute. It has hearts all over it and it's just plain white. And these are um, nice because they have the fold over mittens on them. So that'll keep her from scratching herself if she does. And then this one is really cute. It's like light pink with bunnies and bees, and it's just really cute. I think that's three to six as well. Yeah. All the thicker ones I got are for three to six because it'll be, like I said, fall, winter. By then, then this gray one with little bunnies all over it. Three to six as well. And then I got some newborn ones because I think they're newborn. Yeah. This cute little tie dye old man matches my shirt. That's cute. These all have the fold over mittens with little feet on them. So that'll be good. And she's going to be born in early June, but even then, like it's still chilly at night and we have the, we're always going to have the AC on because it gets really hot up here in the summer. 
like in this apartment. I mean, oh, I didn't even show you that one. This is just a light pink one with little strawberries. Super cute. I'm like itching to put that crib together so bad just so we have that like clutter out of here. And then this cream one with little flowers all over it. So cute. And then the last sleeper I got is just a pink. This is lighter so it'll be good for like warmer nights. Uh, it's like a pink ribbed one. It's like a dusty pink and that's for zero to three as well. The onesies I got, I didn't get too many, I just got a few, but they're really cute. So I got this one, which is 0 to 3, it's like a cream colored with, almost looks like watercolor flowers, really cute. And this is 0 to 3 too, cute little flowers. And this is, I think, my favorite one, it's like a baby blue with oranges all over it. So summery. That's for three to six. I think that was the smallest size they had. And then this gray one with like, it looks like, um, what is that flower? Not lavender. Wisteria. It looks like wisteria, which is so pretty and smells so good. I really hope that some houses have it around here because it's so pretty and it smells incredible. And this is for three to six. It just has little elephants all over it. And the last one I got is just this little like oat one with polka dots. And it has a ruffle sleeve, so that's for three to six. Cute. And then I just put all of my like nursing bras that I've already picked up in that bin too, just so I could put them somewhere. But I, the only place I've purchased them from so far is Target and H&M. Um, I'll show you the things I got from Target first. So, I bought these Honeypot postpartum pads just to see how I like them because I really love this brand so I wanted to try them. I'm gonna put them in like a postpartum bag. Um, and then I got this gray nursing bra by the brand Bravado. It's not padded and it's gray so that'll be for like at home the first month I'm not leaving the house. And then I got two of these Auden nursing bras, one in black and one in like a uh, tan. And I got all of these in small, which I'm hoping is fine. They just look like this. And then I got this pair of maternity sweatpants. They're like seafoam green blue with little tie dye on the bottom. I don't know if I'm actually going to wear these because by that time when I'm that big I'll probably just be wearing Lulu biker shorts and dresses all the time so I might end up giving these away or returning them if I can find the receipt I don't even know if I still have it but then I got um, two different sets from H&M oh they're still attached Okay, I got a pack of the Mama 2-Pack Nursing Bras in black and tan. These are unlined as well. I think I got these in a small. What size? No, I got these in a 6. A US 6. So they're just like basic. You know. Nothing special. But I got a few different brands because I wanted to see which ones I was going to like most. And also I wanted to um, have a different, a couple different ones to bring to the hospital to see which ones I like. And then I got a pack of the Mama 2 Pack nursing tanks. The only thing I don't like about their nursing tanks are they're like very wide. But I mean I guess it'll be comfy. 
I just got them in black and white and I got the size small. But the reason why I wanted to get nursing tanks was because these are good to throw on underneath clothes. I mean, I'm not going to be leaving the house much anyways after we get home, but the reason why I don't like love these is because I wanted to wear these under t-shirts and if they're not like tight like a regular tank top, I'm not going to want to wear them. But we'll see how I like those. So many things we have to do. And then I just put all of my winter, fall and winter clothes away and shoes in there. But I have to have Alex bring it down to the basement because it's heavy. Cute. I really like this color. It's like a really nice earthy sage green. And I just washed them. And it feels so soft. I didn't put the flat sheet on because I hate it. Okay, I just got back from the lab. I had to do some blood work for like a glucose test for my third trimester. Yeah, third trimester. Um, you have to drink this like ridiculously sugary drink and then sit there for an hour. And I felt like I needed to run up and down the walls. <laughs> I was on such a sugar high, but I wanted to give you guys an update on the apartment of like things we've gotten. So I sh tried to show this earlier, but I got these sage, you can see them better now. I got these sage green linen sheets from Target. They're by that Casa Luna brand. It's like so bright you can't even see. But they're really pretty and they're super soft. The other ones I had, I washed them way too many times on the normal cycle so they were starting to feel a little um like papery and just rough but if you wash them correctly and take care of them they last forever and they get better with each wash if you get linen sheets um and they're just they're so comfortable and they keep you cool but they also keep you warm so i'm really happy that I got those. I also want to get us a new comforter because this is a microfiber one and there's so many cat claw marks and like cat fur just sticks to this and it's about that time of year when you don't need a blanket and a comforter. You just need a comforter. But we got these dressers from Walmart. They're um, like I said the other day by South Shore London and you can see them better now. It's like a really really dark it says it was black, but it's like a really dark brown wash on the top and the sides. And then the front faces are like a gray wash with these matte black handles. They're really nice. The drawers are actually pretty small themselves, but I mean, they fit everything we need. And I've downsized so much with all my clothes because after I moved here, I realized how much I didn't want or wear or need. So I got rid of so much. It's not even funny. Um, but I'm thinking today I'm going to move the dresser from this corner to that wall right there and then move the TV stand right here. Hopefully the TV will fit there. I'm going to have to measure and see. But, I mean, it's fine now, but, like, the TV is such an awkward spot right now that I want to try to put it over there. So we'll see if I can do that. I just measured the dresser and it's definitely going to fit, I mean, the length of this and that's going to fit there. I don't know. I'm just going to move it and see if it works. And if it doesn't, I'll just move it back. And then in the living room, this was the bedside table in my bedroom by my parents. Um, and I just put it over here and that's our couch, obviously. Brought that little white futon chair up too. And then I moved the other side table here, and this is the other dresser in the living room. So it fits nicely with the rest of our, like, aesthetic. I also brought this poof up here too, and it goes well with the chair. So, that's our apartment update. I really like these dressers. They look really nice for something you get at Walmart. Walmart actually has some nice stuff. Um... But now I need to bring some stuff down to the basement, like that bin of fall and winter stuff. I'm just going to slide it down the stairs. And then I need to go put some stuff in my car and take the trash and recycling out. And then I'll probably come back up, have something to eat, and move that dresser 
and TV stand. We don't have a real hammer, so I have to use this mallet. I'm gonna start, this is not a cute angle. Hello? I'm gonna start moving these two pieces. Okay. For privacy reasons. I thought it was Sam. Oh shit, was it? I thought it was Sarah. I, just... I like me better when I'm with you. I don't know what it is, but I got that feeling Waking up in this bed next to you, so the room, yeah, you got no ceiling If we lay, let the day just pass this by I might get to too much talking I might have to tell you something I like me better when I'm with you I like me better when I'm with you I knew from the first time I stay for a long time Cause I like me better when I like me better when I'm with you I think this looks a lot better. So the bed is there, and then these are just our side tables for now. They work. It's not a big deal. And then that pink storage bin is in the corner with like extra clothes in it. I moved the dresser over here. I think it looks a lot better. And that way, when I do my makeup in the morning, I can see what I'm doing. I'm gonna hang a mirror, maybe, right there. Or something, I don't know. And then over here is the TV, and it fits like perfectly. <laughs> So, that was lucky. And I don't really, I mean, the only way to make it work over here was to use an extension cord. It doesn't look the best, but I mean, it works, so whatever. But yay. I'll give an overview. I think it looks so much better. Thank <laughs> you. 